Whether it be the large amounts of waste we produce, the lack of recycling, or the potential for microplastic contamination of the environment, there are a lot of reasons to be concerned about the amount of plastic in our food system. We use a lot of single-use plastic for weed control and vegetable beds. Row covers add even more plastic into this system. One possible solution is to try to reduce or substitute the materials used to make raised beds. We can use biodegradable paper mulch instead of standard plastic mulch. However, there are challenges when using paper mulch. It can break down faster, you may need different equipment to install it, or you may even need to install it by hand, which means it may be difficult to scale up and use on larger plot sizes. Additionally, it's not always USDA certified organic, so always check with your certifier first. Another way is to substitute landscape fabric that is more durable than standard plastic mulch, which can only be used for one season. This allows weed control within the beds, but can also control weeds between beds depending on what size landscape fabric is used. Once your crop has been harvested or the season is done, the landscape fabric can be pulled up and stored for the next year. It can also be sanitized in between uses using a backpack sprayer, a pump sprayer, and sanitizer. Lastly, we can reduce our plastic use by reusing the row covers from year to year. Once we are done with a crop or field, we move the row covers to the next crop. Last year, we used the same row covers on three different crops in the spring, summer, and fall. This year, we are reusing those same row covers from last year on three more crops. We also can mend the nets with fishing line to prolong the lifespan. We know that microplastics are a big concern and we hope to conduct future studies on microplastics in the soil and plant tissue. Keep following us as we search for solutions.